Batman and Bill is a 27 documentary from last year. It was on Hulu. Uh, I don't know what that is. I think it's an American streaming service. Um, the synopsis of this documentary is Batman and Bill, directed, written and produced by Don Argo and Sheena M. Joyce, explores the creation of the Batman, how Bob Kane was accepted as the sole creator, and how Bill Finger was never credited for his work, despite him creating the Batman mythos. This documentary is very like Making a Murderer. That's It's like a nerdy Making a Murderer. It, from the get-go, makes it extremely clear that Bill Finger had a large, large part to do in the creation of Batman. But they just never signed anything, never did any, anything. Um, I won't ruin how. That's it in itself. That's quite interesting. And then how Bob Kane just went and took it for a ride and just rode this gravy train all the way home. I really like how Don Argo, the director, the guy, he's, he's just, he is the, he's the PI of this. He's the investigator. He is playing Batman himself here. He wants to dig up and find out why this happened, how, how it happened and what we can do to rectify this. You get insight off of loads of different comic book writers um, and artists like Stan, Lee's, Stan Lee is even involved. The interviews themselves are vast, there's so many people in there, like Kevin Smith again is part, a big part of this. Um, Bill Finger's family are involved in this as well to really give gravitas and then you see old interviews with Bob Kane and it perfectly paints this picture that you, you begin to see that Bob Kane probably didn't have much to that much to do with it even though his name's all over it um, and how Bill well and truly was too humble and too polite and too nice to do or say anything about it this story in itself is a great mystery who created the Batman really and it's so, so fitting for the world's greatest detective to have this behind his actual story behind his creation and I think that's what this documentary sets out to do was Bob Kane underhanded or was Bill Finger just too nice I loved everything about this the cinematography is great using old footage is great um, the, all the interviews are brilliant it didn't feel long at all it wraps up in a, in a nice 90 minutes nothing is missed out of this documentary it's really well done and like I said it's, for, it's a great little crime documentary essentially because that's what this was it's a good crime that this happened and that's what he's doing he's being the Batman Don Argo being the Batman and going in there and saving the day Highly recommend it to anyone who likes a good thrill ride. Um, if you like your comics, or even if you if you just like a, a, like crime crime dramas, this will be for you. Batman and Bill, I give it five docs. Great Scott! Great Scott! Great Scott! Great Scott! Great Scott! What did you think? Let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to rate, like, subscribe, um, and head over to talknerdy.uk for this and more vlogs and blogs. Peace.